You may have heard salad from your favorite YouTuber, not me, and wondered, uh, what is salad? And also, how much money do I earn with salad? Well, I'm gonna answer these questions as concisely as possible because editing this video is gonna make me die. Disclosure, salad did sponsor me a year ago. They sponsored two videos, but I don't think they talked to me anymore because after my first very successful video, they paid me even more for a video that flopped. Thanks for paying my rent, I guess. So what does Salad even do? Well, Salad is a cryptocurrency miner. And uh, looking on Wikipedia, a cryptocurrency miner basically verifies transactions on the blockchain and the miner gets rewarded for it. Uh, if you actually care, you can just uh, read this stuff on Wikipedia. I'm just gonna break it down. The only thing you have to care about is that Salad uses your processor and video card to calculate some sci-fi numbers and gives you credit that you can use to buy stuff. So that brings me to this profitability calculator. Link in the description. Go to enter hardware manually and just enter in your computer's processor. So I have a 5600X and enter in your graphics card by adding another device. I have a 1080 Ti. It's a pretty comparable gaming computer rig, you know, something I wouldn't even scoff at. Then you need to enter in the cost of electricity. Wait, electricity costs money? Yeah, you need to Google your city's electricity rates. In this case, uh, ours is provincial, so BC Hydro says that it's 10 cents per kilowatt hour. I'm going to enter in 10 cents a kilowatt hour. Now, obviously, if you don't have to pay electricity like you live in a dorm or a prison, they're both pretty comparable, then the electricity cost can be zero. However, your university or MIMA will get pretty pissed off if they find out you're mining and raising the power bill. So be considerate. Anyways, you can throw in the numbers and it'll spit out how much you can earn a day using NiceHash. Just note that salad earnings are comparable to NiceHash, so this calculator works pretty nicely. And uh, let's click Calculate. And wow, look at that. I can earn 60 cents a day and live in fear that my landlord will call me and complain about the electricity bill. In fact, if I wanted to buy a new graphics card, a 3080, it'd only take me four and a half years of constant mining to buy it. Wow, maybe I should just look into getting another salad sponsorship or something. So uh, if you're not really a numbers guy and you think, damn, 60 cents a day is a lot and you still want a crypto mine, let me discourage you a little bit more. Don't mine on a laptop, even if it looks like this or as beautiful as this if you uh, squint your eyes. If you mine on a laptop, your laptop will probably overheat and damage your components and crypto mining doesn't kill your PC, it's the high and constant temperatures that do. Also don't mine on an old school computer that your grandma got scammed on Marketplace for. I know that the listing did say it was a gaming computer, but believe it or not, uh, you probably just won't earn anything or you might even lose money because the computer's just not powerful enough to like actually make sense it'll just be a big waste of time the only computer you should consider mining on is a gaming rig or a gamer rig that you'd find on r slash battle stations and uh, if you notice this whole guy's got so much computer he needs a whole entire rack for it this guy's got two big tvs all this stuff is excessive and the reason why these guys would be more inclined to actually crypto mine is that their PCs have good cooling because they're desktop computers and it's beefy components. If these, if this guy can spend, you know, a, a grand on that monitor, then he could probably spend a lot of money on his graphics card, which would make him more money. Just know that a gamer rig with a 3080 would still only be making a dollar and 60 cents a day. In the grand scheme of things, if you just get a job, you will earn a lot more and you won't be stuck with redeeming games or gamer equipment on Salad. So how does Salad make money and are able to afford giving me sponsorship dollars equal to four and a half RTX 3080s? Well, they have margins in the store. Salad doesn't skim off your earnings, at least they say that, but instead they earn money from the store. Anything that they can't get on sale are sold at a markup and things that are at normal cost are items they got for cheap. So. That's why their app is very beginner friendly. If enough young kids use their gamer PCs they got on Christmas, Salad's margins stack up and make them a ton of money. So it's in Salad's best interest to get more and more users and keep them engaged with awards and continuous content. So Salad does make you money, but it's ridiculously slow. Salad can earn you a dollar a day, but with a job you earn minimum wage, which is, you know, $15 an hour where I'm at, and that's one month of Discord Nitro every hour. Not everyone can get an in-person job, and guess what? You can make money by video editing, designing graphics, and coding. I mean, I do YouTube videos and I pay my rent with it, so you know, if it's possible for an idiot like me, it should be possible for you to at least try something and see where it goes. Anyways, I hope I didn't crush your dreams of becoming a millionaire using salad. Best of luck getting that cheddar gamer, and I love you. Mwah.